less interest in this product than they saw with the 4070 Super before it launched. You know, people, they can see if people are searching on their website for keywords and they're seeing less searches than they saw last week for the 4070 Super. They're also having less people call or message them, email them about when it will be available and so they don't think the interest is really there compared to even the 4070 super which this person wanted to remind me sold worse than the 4080 did on day one which at the time was considered a sales disaster additionally and this is where it gets the most shocking part this person told me that they haven't received almost any of these cards that the supply is possibly worse than what they saw with the rtx 3090 launch was a legendary paper launch out of nvidia and well the overwhelming majority of them therefore are above msrp because they have almost none of them to sell and they're marking them up now a second source a person who works at a retailer as well but a different one so that a decent amount of 4070 supers were supplied to them last week but this time around they're getting basically zero supply for the 4070 ti super thus suggesting again much lower supply than what we saw last week which was already low supply for launch and finally the third source that talked to me today who works at a major U.S. retailer, told me that we should not expect good sales for the 4070 Ti Super. Nobody is asking about it ahead of launch, and they don't expect their customers to be happy when they walk into stores and see that most of them are priced well above MSRP, especially because this is a person that told me that basically none of the above MSRP 4070 Supers last week were selling almost any at all. They expect that because most of the 4070 Ti Super is above MSRP, there's going to be a lot of angry people who walk in and then out of their stores tomorrow. Uh, and also, though, supply is notably lower, just like the other sources said. And so they want to emphasize that if it does not sell out in the first week, this has to go down in history as one of the worst NVIDIA launches yet. And actually, this person wanted to tell me that they got more calls for the 4080 super today that i'd already reported in previous videos was already getting some calls uh, according to multiple sources actually at different companies so at this point this person and other people i've talked to as well are expecting that the 4080 super is the one of the super cards that will sell at least okay after launch and they believe that this is because there are a decent amount of people that have been waiting for months to try to get a 4090 for 1600 dollars, and they're giving up they think the 4080 super is at least a little stronger than the 4080, so just like 20% weaker than the 4090. But then it's also, you know, $600 less, and that's just where it needed to be for the people waiting for an MSRP 4090 to just give up and settle for this. And they also think actually some of these calls are people that have seen 4070 Ti Super reviews and are realizing that if they would have just looked at the specs, they could have known this sooner, but that the 4080 Super is actually gonna be a lot stronger than the 4070 Ti Super, and that they should probably just pay the extra money for that if they insist I'm buying something with a green sticker on it. And so there you go. And again, I must remind everybody here that most of you watching this are probably watching this on January 24th. Ergo, the day the 4070 Ti Super actually goes on sale. This was recorded a day before that. And so I cannot promise you if it will or will not sell out. I cannot promise you. But what I can tell you is that if the 4070 Ti Super does sell out on day one or definitely even just like week one, that doesn't mean that it's a great seller because 